Hi, and welcome to Test Rigger's channel. It's an intelligent, generative, AI-powered codeless test automation tool that lets you write test cases in plain English. Let's begin. Element not interactable. Exception in Selenium. Above mentioned error is an exception. Understanding and handling the error in Selenium with Java. Selenium WebDriver is a widely used tool for browser automation across various programming languages, including Java. One common exception developers may encounter when working with Selenium is the error. This video provides a comprehensive understanding of this common exception, its causes, and how to handle it effectively. Additionally, it includes a Java code example to demonstrate handling the exception. Quick question, have you run into the element not interactable exception in Selenium? What caused it for you? Let us know in the comments. What is element not interactable exception? It's an exception thrown by Selenium WebDriver when an element is present in the DOM, but it is not interactable, meaning that the user cannot perform any action on it, such as clicking or sending keys. This exception indicates that the element you are trying to interact with is either hidden, disabled, or in a state that prevents user interaction. Primary causes of element, not interactable exception. The most frequent reasons for encountering this exception include, number one, Element visibility. The target element might be hidden or covered by another element, making it non-interactable. Number two, element state. The element could be in a disabled state, preventing user interaction. If that is the case, it means that the element is designed to be non-interactable to mimic user interactions. Number three, timing issues. The element may be temporarily non-interactable, particularly in dynamic web applications with Ajax and JavaScript. In this case, Selenium might be attempting to interact with the element before it becomes interactable, resulting in the exception. Addressing element not interactable exception. To troubleshoot element not interactable exception effectively, follow these steps. Number one, inspect the element. Check the element's visibility and state, enabled or disabled in the browser's developer tools. Number two, wait for the element to become interactable. Implement explicit, recommended, or implicit weights to provide sufficient time for the element to become interactable before attempting to perform actions on it. Code example. Here the code sample demonstrates handling element not interactable exception in a Selenium Java test. It imports required classes, initializes WebDriver and WebDriver weight, and uses a try-catch block to navigate to a web page, wait for an element to become visible and interactable, and perform actions on the element. If element not interactable exception is thrown, the error message is printed, and the browser and web driver session are terminated in the finally block. This example showcases handling element not interactable exception and waiting for elements to become interactable before interacting with them in a Selenium test. By following the recommended practices and using the provided code example as a guide, you can significantly reduce the occurrence of element not interactable exception and improve the stability of their automated tests. Why element not interactable exception is so common? You can hear why Selenium is not an adequate solution for modern websites here. Smart tools such as Test Rigger don't depend on any locators, and as a QA professional, you can forget about the underlying infrastructure and focus on your test having the best assertions and testing for the right things. You can simply switch to Test Rigger to forever escape element exception issues like the one described in this video. We're done with the video. If you like the content, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel for more informative content on artificial intelligence, software testing, and engineering. Your support helps us build more content to help you further. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comment section. We will try to provide the best possible answer and learn with you together. And here's the good news. Test Rigger offers the AI-driven test automation engineer certification for free. Go get your certificate today. Thanks for watching.